So my wife called me the other day and said, can you stop at the Humane Society and pick up a litter of puppies? So we did. Luke, turn around and show me your puppy. So this is one of them. We got eight of these little three-week-old puppies and their mom. We think they're pit uh, boxer mixes, likely. The mom looks like she's all or mostly pit. Here's a couple more. I kind of know. And then my wife's outside with the mama. There's the mama. She's still nursing a little bit. We're weaning her. And there are uh, the rest of them sleeping cozy in there. But what I really wanted to show you was here in the bathroom. Oh my gosh, our house is so messy. You can't keep up with the house when you have so many puppies. Is uh, we don't really have a whelping box, kind of a small area for a house. So what I did was just make this little gate. They pretty much already taken over our bathroom. We have like a little doggy bed in there, but we were worried they were taking up too much of the space and we wanted to kind of keep them in this area so we could use the, the bathroom for our kids. So all I did was find some leftover plywood, a couple two by fours you can see here, nailed them in, screwed them in. I left a gap because I only had two and I wanted to make it tall enough that the dogs couldn't jump over them already, but I'm a little worried that that gap's too thick and they're going to squeeze through. We'll find out. And uh, I originally thought I'd make up the whole length, but then I thought, well, you know, if I leave a little space, we can... Oh, yeah, I put this here so they can pull it on themselves. Let's take that lock out. Um, you can just slide it. Get the puppies out, take them outside to go to the bathroom, give them baths or whatever, and uh, slide it back. And I put a little little uh, MDF there too to just stop them from being able to push it out of the way. So there's my homemade uh, whelping box gate for our bathroom for our puppies that we're watching for the next few weeks. All right.